friends I came here now in the daytime where you can when you can see much better the volcano and the situation around here next to the church so uh, less people now than in the night but you can see everything very well good visibility nice weather volcano is active I see the lava river running from the volcano down towards La Laguna and but there isn't much ash its conditions are pretty nice so let me show you what is happening this is the church and this is the viewing point here let's come a bit closer very nice condition i mean just light wind so this is the volcano today on november 30th let's zoom in So there you see the lava river, which is running down from the volcano. Actually, it's uh, it splits in two rivers. It's coming from the new wind, and there is another one running here. So there are two rivers. One is to the left here, and the one is to the right. And the river does right. It splits into two, uh, and then it's going down the hills. You see. Uh, it runs down the hills all the way all the way to La Laguna area there let's come closer and uh, see what changes there how much territory lava flooded the developments uh, around La Laguna area so this town here is called La Laguna. You see, we have been flying drone there. The blocks are still there, so there wasn't so much advanced lava movement here. This is somewhat uh, new flow, but I'm not even sure if this is a new thing. Seems like lava is accumulating on the top, uh, on the top of the old flows. Yeah. Here it's very close to the road. This thing is uh, very close to the road here. Here, you see, this this thing came recently. It wasn't here. It's just next to the road here. See? Ya? So there's hot lava here. You see, behind this house. He's moving. And um, uh, Agro Rincon is still there. <laughs> it's uh, surprising. It's so long standing there. It seems like it's some has some divine protection. This enterprise. Uh, this house uh, is a good point. I have been here quite a few times to see the lava flows. It's still there. People. Uh, I think those cars are not. Uh, those cars are tourists that go there and they when they walk to the lava those are not the residents I don't think so by the way it's a good spot to fly drone but I don't recommend to do it because it's illegal but it's a very good spot uh, to walk there in the daytime of course uh, but so then you see around uh, the volcano, Let's, this is the volcano, you see yesterday the group of, from the hostel, like several foreigners, German, Italians, Turkish, uh, Englishmen, they walk it all the way to the lava flows here somewhere, they had been walking here on the sand, next to the lava flows, they had been like making pizza in the lava here can you imagine but they walk us through the forest uh, they have tons of videos but the volcano is not as active as it used to be you know and um, uh, there is a checkpoint here as it used to be uh, this is a checkpoint see the police is there it had been here for months you know this is uh, not a new thing it's uh, it's uh, 
it's all checkpoint. This uh, roundabout is uh, this is LP2 highway. You see, this is LP2 highway, which used to go over there where the police is, all the way to Santa Cruz. Here is LP3 highway that starts and goes up the hill here. This is already LP3 highway. So. <clears throat> Uh, this is the vital road for the for the population of this valley over there, where you have Los Llanos, Los Corte. This is uh, this road connects that uh, that valley with the capital, Santa Cruz. And Lava, as you see, is uh, very close to this checkpoint, to this Grundy Belt. It's, but I'm not sure if we'll make if it has to erupt really. A long time to maybe another one month to to reach here because it's going down, not to the side. It moves somewhat to the side, but primarily movement is of course down over the older flows. You see there is smoke. It's going down over the older flows, and. Uh, Here it's also going through the ravine there, you see, and towards the ocean. So this is the situation. Yeah, here next to the church. And uh, November 30th. So I wouldn't say that lava expanded so much. It's of course... Uh, made some advancement next to this mountain called uh, La Laguna mountain. I was on the top of that mountain uh, during my first trip. And there is always uh, police or rescue teams on the top there. I was here uh, and uh, I walked somewhere from here, from La Laguna. It was the first time. I see the church is still there, so it didn't advance much. Some, some buildings had been destroyed. But not much, so the church is there. Uh, this house was 20 days ago, that is the same, nothing changed. And uh, a lot we went to the ocean between those two mountains, you know. And, uh, so this is how it looks in the volcano there. This is the one of also. This is a new wind there behind the volcano. Before we used it to have lava erupting here to the front. Now it moved to the back side. You see ash is falling out. So there is ash rain there next to the volcano. You see it's raining here ash. And uh, See lots of uh, smoke rising from the ground uh, close to the volcano. As you see, the ground is smoking, so it means the ground is hot there. So there are gases, and uh, it's big lava falls here, or steep run down, and. Uh, And um, it's going somewhere in here. We'll fly drone, we'll see, but... Uh, so this is the situation uh, today. Next to the church. People come here to see the volcano, it's a very nice point, uh, you see it well, of course. If you have a good zoom, you can zoom in into the lava pretty well. See, but not much ash, see how clear sky we have. See, it's clash, it's, it hasn't been like this a month ago. It was also, you couldn't see anything, it was completely cloudy, you see, it's, it's all very nice, sky, so it's... 
station is improving. Uh, it's not so bad. Like uh, something is burning there. Something happened. See the smoke. There. Uh, I don't know what happened. So it's not so bad as it used to be. At least not like two months ago. Two months ago, there was so much noise here that you really you needed uh, earplugs to to not to be disturbed. But terrible noise was here. And, uh, but there is lots of lava coming. That's the point. If before we had ash, now it's lava. There are lava rivers, big lava rivers running down. This is quite serious. The without ash, so it's like more uh, pure effusive eruption now. So it's only God knows when this thing will stop. I don't want to predict now anything. It's, it's a very unpredictable thing, you know. Uh, it's possible to drive this road up. Uh, some people do, you know, all the way up. And some people even walk there, you see, all the way up there. Here, close to the church. It's only for the residents road, but um, uh, I mean, they stop you, the worst thing happens, they will turn you back. But, so, this is how it looks like. And um, here is the situation today, close to the church. You see, the church is open always here. So, I wish you all the best, be well. Now I will drive to the ocean to film the flows that are next to the ocean. <laughs>